and in terms of this is literally in, you know where the process begins to like the the assessment is done at that point the JDAT you know soon after they get them in yes um, and detention staff and our mental health folks will get on board and begin to do their work so you know you look at this and I you know and people are going to look at this and they're going to see the pictures and they see a really hardened facility mm -hmm. and that will freak people out right mm -hmm. say, oh my god these are kids what are you doing mm -hmm. you know so that's where it gets to be that balance right between you know the realities of this facility but then what do we do with with them while they're here mm -hmm. and um, and also to to the extent that we can limit their stay here because you know it is true that it is a hard facility and that long-term exposure to this is not necessarily going to be really healthy for them but you know they they need to be here and the idea is that while we, they are here let's do something productive with them and get them geared up so they can go back out with the resources that they need. Camera in it. And that's for very suicidal. Okay. Or very aggressive kids. And that was on that point if I wanted to be a probation officer. But <laughs> I just like being back here with the kids and, and then dealing with some of the staff as, as, as well. But uh, it's more about, you know, and there, there, there are some particularly like down in the south where there's horror stories about how kids are treated and they show these horrific pictures of 12 year old kids handcuffed behind their back slammed in a cell like that as if they're you know left there to just do whatever and that's not what we're about you know this that's why it's really important to me that the story is about that you know that we have it's a, it's a success that we've re reduced detention it's a success that we're doing other things but detention is a critical piece of the continuum and it is a continuum and the best analogy i think is the the er in the hospital setting that this is the